you came in before Zook was giving his press conference, and you were still in your uniform. Yeah. You said hey to Trenton and Trevor Fallen. Right. Did you meet them before the game as well? Yeah, we saw them uh, in our in our walkthrough um, yesterday, and obviously we we had kind of known about it all week, known that they were going to be coming in. We're excited to see them. Um, and you know, it was definitely hopefully made it a little more exciting for them to, to see a win today. But that's what it's all about. Um, you know, something like that uh, it really grounds you, really keeps you humble about just just a. What an opportunity you have, and really the people that are watching you. I saw you for a I saw you. Get out of there. You like that. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you mean. <laughs> you get inspiration to perform for those guys? Yeah, you do. Um, you know, really with, with a lot of people, uh, you can get inspiration. You really don't realize until you like meet somebody like that that, um, you know, how many people are, have eyes on you and how many people are cheering for you week in and week out. It was special to, to see them yesterday and to have them there at the game. So you're getting through that pile. You're taking it not only for yourself and your team, state of Illinois, yeah. city of Chicago, but those two guys and a lot of other people that we don't yeah, know about. Exactly. There's always a lot of people watching you. There's always a lot of people rooting for you that you don't even know about. My whole body was in the end zone and I didn't hear any whistle or anything. I'm kind of stuck and like it's actually real calm under the pile as much as people always wonder like people punching It's actually pretty calm finally hear the crowd go crazy. So they must have signaled touchdown It took them a little while to call it, but yeah, I knew I was in